guys, welcome back to Finchley Kitchen. Today we're at one of our clients' lovely homes and I just wanted to show you around. So we have two large larder fridge and freezer. So this larder fridge, you get lots of drawers, lots of storage. Um, a feature that the client really wanted was the, this open shelving unit. So this is a really nice place for her to store all of her serveware and her de decorative pieces that she's spent the last few years collecting. Um, it's, and it's also just a really nice way to frame the hob area. As you can see in this kitchen, we also have no wall units. And this is something I really like because when you have a kitchen of this size, you're not limited on storage, especially when you have maybe an additional utility room as well for more storage. So in this kitchen, what we've done is we've just put one piece of tinted mirror all the way up the back of the hob. So it just kind of makes the room feel a lot bigger and it reflects the light. It's also a really nice way to add some luxury with a tinted mirror. As you can see, we have a nice stainless steel Elica extractor, which just kind of draws your eye up to the really tall ceiling heights in this kitchen, which is really nice. We've also centered the hob between these two units. We've got nice big cutlery trays and then also nice big pan drawers underneath as well. And then again, another open shelving unit, but this one is partly decorative, partly functional because we've got plates and everything here. So when you have guests coming around, they know exactly where the plates are. They don't need to be going into all of your drawers and trying to look, for, look around for things. So this is a Siemens kitchen. So we've got all Siemens appliances, so Siemens hob, ovens, microwave. So we've got a really nice IQ700 microwave here. As opposed to a combi, we went with a microwave in this kitchen. And then we've got storage above and below the ovens, as well as a nice shelved larder unit to the right. And then in the island, we have a nice undermount Blanco seal granite sink with a stainless steel tap with a hose feature, as well as a soap dispenser as well. Um, we've got two cupboards underneath the sink with the dishwasher to the left. So the cleaning station is very easy. If you like doing your dishes, watching TV, this is a really nice function. This is a really nice place to put your sink. I would say my favorite part about this island and this kitchen is probably this open shelving unit here because it's partly, it's, it's, it's functional and it's decorative because we have plants that are right opposite the bifolds. So great place for your plants, really nice place to keep your um, cookery books and cookware that is nice and also functional. On this side of the island, we've got lots more storage as well as Underneath the seating, we have some shadow cupboards as well. As you can see in this kitchen, we are not short of storage. So the wall units above the hob, just not very necessary. It's nicer to keep it open and just make the room feel a lot more open and inviting. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed watching this episode, why not watch one of our previous kitchen tours and subscribe to our channel for all future projects. If any of the features in this kitchen really stood out to you, please let us know in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you. Or you could also visit our showroom for more 